So we are at the Coca-Cola um, Space Science Center. Yeah, for the uh, Columbus Toy and Comic Show. So I guess it's kind of vacuum toilet. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, um, <laughs> creepy. Yeah, for the spaceship. I guess. For the spaceship. So we're going to be seeing, I guess, a lot of different things here because it looks like the booths are kind of just kind of thrown in there because we see something over here, but then we got space stuff. So <laughs> it's, go it's going to be, it's going to be interesting. So you're going to see a lot of different things, um, space stuff and toy stuff. Here we go. Hopefully the lighting is good. Are we supposed to go in that room? Yeah. 
bin over there. Oh, yeah? Oh, that's cool. Some of the tallest jaws I've ever seen. Shirt, sir. Oh, oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and um, you know, this is this is some of my photography on the TV there. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Um, some of my photography on this box. Oh. And then um, everything you see here, you know, from Stonehenge down to the bases and everything, I hand carved and painted myself. Do you do commission work? Uh, yes, I do. Do you have a car? Yeah, if you have a because we have, have a, a channel that, and that is usually uh, I do have an picture. Instagram. Okay, tell it to us. Uh, it is at a Blankton on Instagram. It's actually on the TV right now. Okay. Oh, there you go. Instagram. Yeah, give me a follow. That's awesome. Yeah, and we'll put this video up on our YouTube, so if you want right, to see it I'll, I'll or refer it. I'll, I'll, I'll uh, do a little bit of promotion on uh, IG and Facebook and all that, but I'm um, glad to have you over here. You know, mm -hmm. Enjoy yourself. Plenty of other great artists here. It's my first time actually setting up. Oh, okay. Wow. You guys see all this good stuff over there. Yeah. Um, don't call us an asylum for nothing. Feel free to flip through and. Look at a predator. Yeah. Oh, right. yeah. Prince yeah. He's a comic book writer and creator, Chris Garrett. That was I'm actually working on the next issue of the DEA. And so these are my freebie comics. If you want to take one, feel free. Yep. Yeah. 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 So we just left the Columbus toy and comic show give yeah. us a rundown how was that um not at all what was expected no i admit yeah. i was very very disappointed and um because you know it felt like from reading it i did try to look it up on the computer to get um, pictures to get an idea of what to expect sometimes you can get an idea of what to expect but this one was a very small room and I'll say yeah. it was maybe what 10 vendors if that yeah, many and half of them were just uh, artists yeah trying to you know promote themselves artists and um yeah they, they did art and they had a comic book person yeah i and saw there were two places that had comics and they were mobbed yeah and so it, it's it's not at all what was expected i you know we talked to one of the vendors yeah we met him at the um toy swap yeah in powder springs he said they used to be more this is a lot smaller than normal mm -hmm. but still and this is an important lesson in that because sometimes you have to know when to walk away mm -hmm. because you you'll end up impulse buying there's a lot of people that probably came here and they were like man i went through all this trouble i'm getting something yeah because and you'll for, end up buying something you really don't need or want yeah because for us it was a two-hour hike to get here yeah. and that's not bad if it's a bigger show but when it was the size of this and hopefully you can tell from the video because I did film yeah. every single vendor and yeah. this is a short video um, um, for two hours and for this it was kind of small I mean you know if you live closer maybe like 30 minutes it's not that bad yeah plus you're um, paying a cover charge yeah you know six dollars to get in which is not bad uh -huh. um, 
But you know, it's it, for two hour for a two hour trip, four hours round trip. Um, yeah. It's a bit much. Although she did get this. I did get a Gumby <laughs> figure from that same guy. Um, we saw it when we were at the Pops, not Pop, um, Swap Meet. Yeah. Um, and I just didn't get it there. And it was something else I wanted to look at, and the guy was so nasty. Yeah. I just walked away. I was like, forget it. Big tip. You know, if, you, uh, if you're coming to a show and you want to sell stuff, talk to the people who and answer their questions. I mean, don't be all rude. Yeah, because she was like, hey, can I see... Well, it was a Batman piece, and she was like, can I see the Batman uh, figure? And he goes, it's not a figure. It's a toy in a box. And she was like, well, can I see the toy? And he says, it's very expensive. Like that. And it's like, all right, you know what? Yeah. Obviously, you don't want to sell anything. Goodbye. Yeah, because <laughs> he was like, well, it's expensive. And I'm like, okay, it's expensive. It's very expensive. I just walked away. Yeah, she, I'm like, dude, what is your issue? Blew her off like three times. Yeah, and so, and I'm like, um, you know what? Forget it. Keep you your wanna, figure, you your wanna, toy. You don't want to sell it, put it under the table. Yeah, then he act like he don't know what I'm talking about. When I say, can I see your, um, can I see your item? What are you talking about? You know. Uh, so, you know, if you don't want to sell something, <laughs> don't put it on display or put it on display and put a sign on it that says not for sale. Because yeah. I have seen that. We have seen that at shows. People will just have something on display, but they'll put a sign on it, not yeah. for sale. Oh, oh, I okay. that at that one show where the guy had the Kenner Alien. Yeah. Cover. And I was like, how much is the Kenner Alien? He says, um, actually, I'm not selling it. I just brought it to show. Yeah. Like, I, yeah, I, I really don't want to part with it is that okay yeah and that you know, that made sense but he wasn't fine. rude no you know um he was just no that's not for sale i just brought it oh, okay cool i can deal with that but david wanted to look at some of the guy comic books he didn't look at it yeah because after that happened i was like you know what i don't want to look at this guy's yeah i'm gonna keep let's, my let's money yeah. in my pocket because because so. Uh, Joe, uh, Toy Lanta sure is coming up here. In yeah, like, in like, what, 20 days or something? Yeah, it's like in the next three weeks. Yeah, and, and we'll keep our little change <laughs> in our pocket and take it to Toy Lanta where people want to sell. <laughs> okay. Anyway, you got anything else? No, I guess that'll do it. <laughs>